Greetings. Hello, welcome back to more long more of the chosen mod jam. And we're gonna be fighting the Berserker Queen again. A little bit of a troop column. Tiny, tiny troop column. Position is obscured. Just eleven enemies. But yeah, let's let's see if we can take it on this time. This is the chance we've been waiting for and all of that. Ooh, it's the the bar, the bar and grill from from enemy unknown, enemy within, XCOM one, whatever you want to call it. Acknowledged. Stay frosty. Is that was that a rainbow pot? Are really gonna have just a group of eight advent, and then somewhere on the map there's uh, the berserk queen with a few buddies. Got it covered. It certainly feels that way. All right. Um, up here, that's great. <laughs> so you require my aid? How expected. Yeah, it's not quite where I wanted to move you, but that's gotta have to do for now. See that guy? Cool. Let's show some hustle. Let's show some hustle. In position. So, you can either move to that area, then we can just gonna kind of saturation fire you, or you can move to this area, and then we can flame throw out of you. Not like we're not giving you any choice here. We wait another turn. We should only move eight tiles at most. Two, three, four, five, seven, eight, which is not gonna flank jet. Like how you have basically no detection range against civilians, that's fantastic. Um, yeah, let's get Jason in here. We could also just take the engagement, but I think having them a little bit closer might just be fun after all. Eyes on the prize. Grapple here, grapple there, or grapple back here. Did I ever mention that I really like grapple and the flexibility it gives here? Put hollow target some stuff so it stays hollow targeted for next turn. Like maybe that that priest. If my eight tile thing still is still holds true. Only moved seven tiles. Oh, oh hi. Looks like one of them came back for more. Let's make sure to take it out this time. Well, this is kind of awkward, though.
All right, so here's how this one's gonna play out. Um, we gotta gonna get some. Is with oh, hang on. I was going to say, because of an elite priest being here, we're not going to panic any one of those guys. So Flamethrower loses some value. But in Mod Jam, Technical Flamethrower actually has a 100% chance to set enemies on fire. It's guaranteed. In basic Long War of the Chosen, it's only 60%. So this might kill Sentinel Grenadier. We're gonna kill the Muton. Just leave everybody else really low. The flamethrower is gonna put six people on fire. I don't know, man. I don't know. The Berserker Queen being here in the middle of things is not gonna make it easier. Um, The capacitor discharge that for five to eight damage. Ooh, and the disorient that's immediately going to get removed from that priest. Um, but we might still actually do that afterwards to come in with a reaper chain. I think we take the set fire. Set fire, hit all of them, hit the muton. And then probably it's going to be grappling, disabling shot on the Berserk Queen. And then we see if we go from there. Ah. I was, I feel, I feel kind of robbed. Where was shot? I was shot. Make sure I actually see the queen. Maybe this close to everybody. Now, no, I was, I was thinking with death from above, I could kill some guy and then disabling shot the queen, but I need both actions for the disabling shot.
I mean, that's free. It shouldn't cause a reaction. Six damage here, yeah. thirty left. Um, all right, I think then it's gonna be a command. Country. Go. Got him. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. I'd love to ask Valen what exactly she planned on doing with this thing. I would be curious to hear her reasoning. Although I would question whether reason was ever involved in this decision. All right. So much, so much crap here. Time to take out the trash. That too. Posizione compromessa. Possibili dati individuati. Bersaglio eliminato. Nemico eliminato. I know the song is don't fear the reaper, but they should fear the reaper. Um, actually, since this is everything that's on the map, let's make sure you get a kill here. So you don't feel left out. Alright, 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 alright. Commander. I suppose I'll have to take this a little more seriously. Burn just on the muton, okay. And then we can take a regular shot at this guy. Priest, I'd like to have a quick talk with you. If you heard about our Lord and Savior Bladestorm. Positive confirmation. Area secured. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. That Ration Fire, pretty good opener. Try doing that with Hunter Protocol. Pretty sure I saw that on an album cover decades ago. Even now, our enemy lurks in the shadows. Plotting to destroy all we have built. To return us to the chaos of the old world. Only together can we oppose them. United in the... We're taking Advent apart one mission at a time, Commander. Impressive work. Having recovered another of Dr. Valen's modified alien test subjects, we should begin an autopsy as soon as possible. By following her own research notes, it is my hope that we will uncover the true purpose of her work. Well, that was, uh, that was quick. I guess if, if they line up like that, what, what are you going to do, right? That's, that's just the way that mission is going to go. Um, hang on, before we do that, let's have a quick look. We have four days until the supply drop. Also reduce the strength again here, which is nice. Um, we 
don't necessarily have to kill your next supply drop. You're not gonna start the Avenger defense, uh, Avenger assault yet. Uh, what are you currently doing anyway? Doesn't it show... Am, am I going crazy now? Shouldn't it show somewhere here current, current chosen action? It's sabotage. Alright, yeah, no. I think that failed this month? Or we countered it? One of those. Let's do the bone training. A VIP extract with a revealed start on a great timer for a scientist. Like, if my main goal here is to do, get some experience, then I should totally do that. Just think my, my roster is a little bit messed up right now. That seems like a good start for a mission. Um, get you out of there. Let's get some people like from the, the mid-range squads, um, mid-range mid ranks here into this. Let's get our spark. Scouting, we do have grenades, we do have sniping, we do have rockets, like a little bit more shooting might be nice. Yeah, let's get the skirmish in here. So you're more a grenader than a shooter, it's gonna be fine. Bit of a long timer, but I think I'm okay with that. No, actually I'm not. Let's get you out of there. Just do it with six. Um, getting in seven people just spreads the XP thinner uh, across more people. And you are way longer. So you can't cycle missions that quickly. Now let's just go in the six, launch it a hundred percent. In position to drop. Should be fine. Facility lead, short timer. I think I'll I'll skip that one. I'm 
that and we can do some stuff with you well it's always going to be fuse if fuse is offered together we have succeeded in our task yeah, i think we have like three days until the the month ticks over so we can easily do one more quickie here It's a five day one, an alien loot is usually bad. I think it's probably gonna be just to gather supplies. I really kinda wanna get my combat engineer, you know, I'm still thinking, hey, if he ever reaches Master Sergeant and has this slam fire thing, he's just gonna murder everything, but some reason at some point of this campaign i stopped running missions with, with cloud that makes me sad jailbreak for a bunch of rookies which we don't need and one resistance guy it went down to two over here Would it be broken if Jailbreaks gave you actually ranked soldiers later in the game and not rookies anymore? Setting course for Eastern European Ward. Okay, so Pagan is in uh, officer training, which we could cancel if we really want an officer here, which we might. Or we just bring... Yeah, let's bring Rick Tom as a backup officer. Oof. Still there infiltration time though. Not gonna boost jailbreak. Uh, that's already above the infiltration time. Um I actually don't think we can do this. Not with this squad. continue to make progress on the avatar project if we're going to slow them down we'll need to move fast yeah we should at some point also consider doing this i kind of want to take down the hunter first The lip one with a good timer. That's that's the, the one mission we're gonna do now. Western Europe. So was this enough to get you in there? Hopefully not. Some stuff we can probably do with weapons and, and attachments. Ah, that's just... I'll do a quick... I'll do an off-camera equipment here. And see if we can squeeze in enough uh, bonus to get the timer. I'll be back with you in a second. 
Right, here's the squad. Um, fully equipped. I basically went around and collected every elite suppressor we had anywhere lying around and um, had them equip on the various weapons of the squad here. So, um, yeah, five people with suppressors. Everybody else fully equipped. That seems like it gives me just enough time to run this mission. And let's go then. See the empty PCS slots, and I was like, okay, what, what do I want to do in here? I wonder how trigger happy it's going to interact with a flamethrower. And I don't think it does at all. Probably would want the speed PCS on you. And no idea what I want here. Sky Ranger deployed. In position for deployment. Alright, another mission. Another lip one. Advent Courier's staging area. In escorted by a large number of heavily armored custodians. Okay. Yeah, I don't think we can we can screw around with that kind of mission. So let's get a few of the not screwing around people. And see what kind of squad we can set up for this. Setting course for Sector Six, Eastern Europe. So yeah, I definitely want those two. Here's the deal. If we just bring Master Sergeants, then why are we doing this mission? Just for the intel? This Advent Courier has some... is, I think, guaranteed to drop loot, so we might get some good drops, which we don't really need. Maybe just want to flex on some Custodians. First of all, you kind of want a... You just keep the coil rifle. I have mobility. Um, like I know that it's a waste of 87 aim to not have it, but mobility 11 seems really low. Um, I kind of want that Vortex grenade. See how that performs. Make sure you're fully kitted out here. Not my first choice of blade, but I think it's it's gonna have to do. Okay, you obviously need something with an uh, elite expanded magazine. That's I think that's your rifle. What's arc floor? That looks good. Um, do we have more warden armors lying around? Two more. Okay. What a coincidence.
Yeah, so we've got snipes, we've got um, Void Conduit and stuns for the Custodians, we've got Cyclic Fire Shredder, Chain Lightning, good tons of ways to deal with them. I'm just gonna get a stutter mark here. Or some, uh, yeah, typical whatever attachments on them. Gotta be good enough. I don't think I have what it takes to get another fusion blade, but I always confuse that it takes a mutant elite corpse and not an archon corpse. So now let's let's go to fusion blade. So much more reliable damage and also higher damage. Let's see, thing runs for you. Workstation Advent Train. I think you need a battle scanner, really. Give you an advanced med kit. Alright, that's good. Ranger deployed. Squad green to deploy. Setting course for the Western European. Want to continue scanning over here. Find some omissions. Um, we're going to have the supply drop coming in very soon. It's just going to give us a ton of supplies. Some sort of dark event finishing here in a second. Not much we can do about that. Incoming message for you, Commander. Patching it through to your quarters now. You have made considerable progress against the aliens over the past month, Commander. I hope that your ongoing efforts will only lead to further success. Additional dark event. Okay. Fortress. That's bad. <laughs> That's not great either. And that's the one that's gonna come in, in very soon here. Avenger plotting new course. Hundreds of, I'm not sure if I ever got this much income outside of my global liberation campaigns. This then. Um, yeah, I kind of want to do that. I, I don't think I can actually wait for the supply drop. Uh, do we still have enough people for do that? Maybe wait for the supply drop. Then we have both our officers also back, and then we can see what we can build. So with Ethereum Jets now researched, we can in the GTS get dynamic deployment. Really interested to see how that's going to shake out. We do not have counter chosen activity. Okay. Could get another Reaper. That's interesting. Why do we not get the recruit missions off for the other guys? Oh, 
probably gonna set that up. I think I'll also wait until we have that mission going. Uh, hello. Two days, five hours. Okay, then I really can't do that. That's gonna make all these other missions here a lot more difficult. We're coming into strength six then. I wonder where that supply rate is coming from. Okay, but if we want to do the, the the VIP rescue here, setting course for Eastern Europe. Yeah, that seems like a squad that can can handle that. Obviously not in that time. Okay, everybody here has equipment. Um, hmm, I don't think we have any more high-end spark weapons, no. Okay, take that one for now. Can we already get the the good spark armor? I don't think so, actually. The another dice chassis or whatever it's called. So this is cheap enough. Get a reinforced frame for you. And then I'm removing you from the squad layout, giving us enough time to infiltrate, and if they Liam jets, I should be able to call you in. Alright, cool. Um, we're gonna need two more war numbers. And I think I wanna go with a shotgun. Not the master. Yeah, turbulent plasma street sweeper. That's the one. Let's side, please. Um, advanced mark. Let's commit to the crit. And last but not least, something's not quite right. Yeah, that's the wrong weapon. Yes, I can afford another scram gun for you. Can I?
Can I find it in the list? That's the real question. Your hack is hacking score is really low for for someone whose main job is hacking. Um, all right, uh, fix your body. That's so bright. That's so bright. Uh, I still don't have anything for you as in better PCS, so you're just gonna rock rock the place with 74 willpower. You uh, could probably get some better stuff for you. Most importantly, the the the, the beam, whatever it is. Fusion Plasma Shadowlands Almost had it And maybe we also have the good throwing knives I didn't see them anywhere I think, maybe. That's my throwing knife. You were, you're supposed to crit, which you know sounds really weird to say it like that. Um, do you ever have a heavy barrel for you? Either we don't, or we cannot equip that. Better sword would be nice, but I think we're now kind of out of options. No, never mind, there's a fusion blade lying around. Hang on, there was even a fusion axe lying around. That. Because that's gonna work with impulse. Menace, ready to deploy. So, by continuing to run Intel here with Strength 6, we're risking retaliations. But we just, but a few days ago, had the Intel retaliation. We avoided the full retaliation. I think we're good. Uh, before we do anything else, I want to have a quick look at the supply rate. Uh, see how many enemies are coming in. 19 to 21, which tells me absolutely nothing because I can never remember the numbers. But I think that m is coming from Eastern US? Maybe New Brazil, I don't see that anyway. Why have I not unlocked this? I guess because I never have intel, but man, 20% on 1500 income at the moment. Holy crap. Yeah, let's get some more alloys. In the room. 
might do also a quick selling session. Scap weave. Do I sell some stuff? That's so tedious, but I think I, I should. I have a, a lot of money, but I could always have more. You know, can't be can't be bothered. All right, um, we are at a hundred percent for the smashing grip there. This is all these missions. I think we set them up when it was strength three, and it went up to five now. Might have had a U of O landing somewhere in between. Setting course for Sector 7, Western Europe. So from an equipment and level point of view, right? We can probably do other missions. Um, the main reason I'm doing more missions is we don't know where the other um, story missions are going to be. So we need more intel to probably contact more regions. And you can get intel from any mission with Skulljack, hack rewards, etc, etc. Um, not even sure why you stopped the scan there. Over action. And that being said, we should probably also just do Intel covert action here. That's not how you do that. And just right click out of this. Our order is clear and we will obey it. Okay. Not a big deal. Is, is annoying, but at least it's not Bastion. Alright, and that puts this at 111, must launch, but it ticked down to vulnerable 10 to 12. Heavy Bio Assault. Elite Sniper can be nasty, but the rest should be manageable, especially with a fairly strong squad here. Uh, Operation Mountain Dance, Supply Crate Extraction in the Wilderness, coming up in the next episode. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.